Hello, thanks for watching. Edward here, and in this video, I'm going to teach you a little bit of how how to uh, how to generate clickable image ads on Facebook. Uh, this is obviously something that uh, a lot of people don't seem to know how to do. Uh, some of you may know how to do it, and that's fine. But you know, I mean, I, I do look around the place, and I can see on people's timelines they they're posting um, their posts, but I can see that their their image ads um, are not really coming up. Um, probably the way they want want it. Um, let, I mean, let, give, let me give you an example. If I go into a money making group, um, and I can see, you know, people are posting their their links, and you know, when you post a link from an affiliate website or a post or a link that you're promoting or whatever, you often don't get a lot of choice of the preview image that comes up automatically. The Facebook is automatically looking for a preview image of of the page that you're that you're promoting on Facebook. Um, and often we don't get a lot of choice. Um, I mean, look at this one here. Um, it's sort of cut off. And, you know, some of it might work. Like this one, for example. This is a clickable image ad. This is fine. And when I click it, I know I'm going to go to their website. Um, but the um, the word is cut off or whatever. I mean, I'm sure that's not really what they, they would have wanted. I mean, <clears throat> if the affiliate themselves wanted to kind of customize the image a bit better and make it look better then that would have been fine you know i realize that i'm i might be a little bit uh you know a perfectionist or, or whatever but uh, to be honest i mean i know that a lot of people would prefer to have a bit of their own customization i mean this this is fine you know it's 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 exactly what it needs to be you know it's it's full it's full screen but if i click it um it just comes up it pop it pops up even larger so there's no actual link so if i that may be their their that may be their choice and that's fine if that's the case and then no problem at all but in some cases you know when um when i click their their image i don't go to a website and that that may be that may be fine uh, that may be what they expected like for example this one that just goes to their image um, in larger view um, but i realize that they have a link here as well which is not very easy to see not very obvious um, but if this was clickable and it went straight to this link here, then they that would have been something better for them, I would have thought. But anyway, you know, um, I'm not being critical in any way. I think that's fine. And uh, I know that most people would be fine about that. Um, but anyway, what I'm going to show you is, you know, let, let's take this 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 one, for example. When I click this, I, um, I go straight to my landing page. And this image was my choice. I, I, you know, I decided that this is exactly the image that I wanted. And when I click it, I go to the exact page that I wanted to send it, send, send my leads to. Um, so, you know, if you're gonna, if you're gonna send out, you know, links on Facebook, you know, why not have a, you know, have a, have an image there of your choice, and that will, when they, when you're when your viewers click that image, they're going to go straight to your landing page. Uh, presumably, that's what a lot of people would prefer. So I've got this this free tool here. Um, it's basically link to fb.com. Yeah, link to fb fb.com. I'll put it in the description below, but I think you've got it. Um, so basically, I'm just going to reset this. And start all over again. So basically, uh, with this tool, you can put in either a, a, a URL to a video file uh, on YouTube, or um, directly to a landing page. Um, videos. If you put a video, uh, a YouTube video in there, it looks very good um, because, like on my timeline, for example, the other day I posted a video where the preview was a bit small. I would have preferred. Sometimes I've seen videos posted where the preview is quite big you know it fills up and that's what I wanted but for some reason I didn't get that choice uh, Facebook didn't present it like that which is a bit uh, annoying but anyway with this tool you you always get it large and you can even customize your own image of your choice and you can put in your play button there custom play button or not it's up to you or make it play automatically I think I've not tried that yet um, so but with this example I'm just gonna put in a, a landing page um, right there and then it'll preview it and then I'm just going to grab some text for this example 
and uh, description. <clears throat> I'm not going to use a, vi um, a video play button because it's not a video, so uh, I'll leave that blank. And then I'm going to upload a thumbnail of my choice. Any image will work. I think this tool suggests uh, a six, um, an image of something like 600 by 350 pixels. But I think whatever image you upload, it's going to resize. I don't know. Uh, but you can also play around with the uh, preview mod yeah, the tools here. Uh, and then that's basically what it's going to look like on Facebook. So um, all you do now is you just grab your link. It'll take 30 seconds um, to generate. I think that's because it's a free version, but I think you can upgrade for five dollars and get more features. Um, for example, take this out if you don't want that, but it's fine as far as I'm concerned. Um, or a few other things. <clears throat> so anyway, yeah, you can use videos or images and you can totally customize it, sending people directly to whatever landing page. Now, I would highly recommend that you read the terms and conditions from Facebook, you know, don't violate Facebook's terms. Um, but basically, yeah, I'm just giving you an example of how you can use this tool. And then when I post that link here that they, they give me um, onto my timeline or into a Facebook group, um, I'll just show you what it looks like. Wait for the preview. So the preview comes up. Um, I'm just gonna delete that URL now that the preview's there. And you could write a post, um, and I'm going to post it only to me for now because I don't, you know, just for this example. So when I click post, <clears throat> there it is. So my image of choice, and when they click it, it'll go to my landing page of choice, and it's got a little preview of the text. Probably don't even need to put anything in there if you don't want to. You can just keep it blank and just have the image. It's up to you. Uh, but it looks quite nice to have something in there. And, and 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 you have control of that as well. So when look what happens when they click that, it goes straight to your page. And the other good thing is, um, I've also noticed with some affiliate programs, they actually block your um, your links um, because Facebook doesn't like you promoting those particular URLs for whatever reason. They've been blocked because a lot of people have been abusing it or whatever. So with you using this tool they give you a link they give you a url so you're basically they're basically cloaking your url and you can also have choice here um i think it seems i'm not quite sure about that but basically anyway they by by posting this shortener url um you won't get blocked so yeah there you go anyway thanks for watching that's how you post clickable image ads using custom Im images and, and la um, click, allowing them to click straight into your landing page of choice. Anyway, thanks for watching and uh, talk to you soon. Bye for now.